This is the Card Sharks Tournament of Champions. Justin Bowen has already advanced to the finals. And we're going to do one more set of semifinal games right now. So let's get to the cards. All right. And our first contestant who has won over $115,000 in cash and prizes to be exact, $115,595 in cash and prizes. He's uh, the second seeded player of card charts is Gary Newkirk. How you doing, Gary? I feel really, really happy. I bet you are. <laughs> He's so happy only because the Bears beat the sh excuse me, the Bills <laughs> The Bills beat the Chicago Bears. I want the Bears to beat y'all ass. But it didn't happen. Because you wanted your Bears to beat us, Bob. We beat you. Moving along. And his uh, opponent, another semifinalist who has just got into the tournament from nowhere, Winning $74,700 in the tournament, or in the season, Matthew Bingo. Bingo. It's close enough. Hey, Matt, was you kind of surprised that you got in so quickly? Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. Well, uh, do you think you can do it here? Absolutely. Okay. Well, good luck to you. Speak very loud so we can hear you and the YouTube audience can hear you. Okay, let me turn up my mic here. Yes. And uh, guys, um, in the Tournament of Champions, y'all going to be playing the best two out of three match. And the winner of these uh, semifinals are going to go on to face Justin for the jackpot, which is currently at $255,900, okay? All right. The first game, if you win, is a thousand dollars, and if you manage to win the second game, we'll give you another two thousand dollars for three thousand dollars total. And if you get it right on the nose in the uh, high-low question, we're gonna give you a five thousand dollar bonus. Okay? Okay. Here we go. We gain off to the uh, card sharks game, and Gary, you're gonna start off first. Okay? And good luck to the both of y'all. All right, Gary, we asked 100 women who have, been, who have been married 25 years or more, does your husband have one particular habit that didn't bother you when you got married but drives you crazy now? How many women said yes? Oh boy, I believe a lot of us, a lot of y'all married men probably have that one particular habit that y'all like that can drive a woman nuts. But, um, that's gonna be a number between 110. Um, I'm gonna say around the, around the corner of 53. He's going with 53. All right, Matt, is it higher or lower than 53? Hmm. Let's go higher. He's going higher. Okay, if it's higher, Matt, you'll play your cards. If not, it goes to Gary. And Gary, if it is 53, you get $5,000 bonus, okay? All right. The actual number of uh, married women that said that they have, that their husband has one particular habit that don't, didn't bother them um, then, but it bothers them now, is 47 is not higher, it is lower. So, Gary, you get it. Okay. Gary, you have a 10 showing. What do you want to do with that 10? I want to stop in the name of love and change that card. Okay, he's changing the 10. The 10 becomes an ace. Good change. So, let's go down. Lower than ace. It's a seven. I want to be a little risky and go a tiny bit higher. Oh, he's going for it. Higher than a seven? No, it's a three. Okay. Free chance go to you, Matthew, and you're playing off the two. Higher. Higher than a two is a seven. Mm. I'm risking it. Let's go higher. He's going for it. Higher than a seven. 
It's a double, no good. Uh, no progress, but we go on, and Matt, you're up. Matt, we, we found 100 male fashion models and asked them, when you're not working, do you ever wear makeup on your face? How many male models say yes, they do wear makeup on their face when they're not working? That's got to be low, I'm telling you. Um, I'm going to say probably around 35. He's going with 35. Okay, Gary, is it higher or lower than 35? I'm going to try and go lower than that. He's, he, he's going even lower than that. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of male models that said they do wear makeup on their face when they're not working is 56 is not lower, it's higher. Good job. Wow. Okay, um, Matt, you have the... um. Um, Ace showing. Do you want to change that card? Wrong person. I have the two. Oh, sorry. I looked at the wrong person. You're just so upset because we beat you. That's why. <laughs> yes, I am. I'm pissed off. Alright. A two. Um, do you want to change that card, Matt? No. Okay. What do you want to do about that? Higher. Higher than a two. It's a six. Hmm. I'm not going to risk it. Freeze. He's freezing on the sixth. All right, and we go on to our next question. It goes to you, uh, Gary. All right. Gary, we found 100 women who are millionaires and asked them, if you could wake up tomorrow as one of the most beautiful women in the world, but all of your money would be gone, would you do it? How many women millionaires said they would do it? There are girls these days who wish they would have the looks instead of the money. Um, but um, there's also that type of women who don't really care about their looks and rather just be gold diggers instead. Mm-hmm. So you know what? That's my medium number of 54. Going 54. Okay, Matt, is it higher or lower than 54? Hmm. Let's go. Higher. He's going higher. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of millionaires that said they would do it is 66. It is higher. Good job, Matt. Mm -hmm. And Matt, you have the uh, six showing. What do you want to do with that six? Change that six. Okay. The six becomes, wait a minute, let me change it. The six becomes another six. Um, let's go higher. Higher than a six. No, it's a two. Gary, free chance to you. You have to play off the ace. Lower. Lower than the ace. It's a six. Lower. Lower than a six. It's a two. Higher. Higher than a two. It's a nine. Lower. All right, for the first game and a thousand dollars lower than the nine. No, you go all the way back to your eighth. And this is the fourth and final question. So I must win off this play of the cards. And control is critical. And this question goes to you, Matt. We asked 100 men who belong to the Sigma Chi fraternity. How, was your father also a member of Sigma Chi? How many said yes? Never heard of that before, so I'm just gonna take a random guess and say eh, 58. Going 58. Okay, is it higher or lower than 58? Mm, that's a good number. I'm gonna try and say lower. Going lower. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of men who belong to the Sigma Chi fraternity is 68 is not lower is higher. Okay, Matt, now here's the situation. You have a six showing and you have the power to change that six if you want to, but you have three cards to go in order to win game number one. Um, Gary has an ace showing. 
He does not have the power to change it, and he has four cards to go. Now you can play it yourself, Matt, or pass it to Gary and force him to play. I will keep control and change that to six. He's keeping control. Okay, the six becomes a five. You have to call all three cards right or the game goes to Gary. Higher. Higher than a five. It's a queen, continue. Lower. Lower than a queen. It's a jack. Lower. For the first game in $1,000, lower than a jack. No, and goes to Gary. Oh, wow. Good wow. job, Gary. Wow. $1,000, so you have $116,595. Now we're all ready to go for game number two of the best of uh, three match. And Gary, this is your question. We asked 100 farmers in Iowa, have you ever been to Paris? How many farmers said they have been to Paris? Mm, oh boy. How many farmers said they've been to Paris? Yes. Uh, okay. That's gonna be a little number. I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna have to say 46. He's going 46. Is it higher or lower than 46, uh, Matt? Hmm. Let's see, that's a good number, but I do have to consider something that French people hate Americans, so I'm gonna go lower. He's going lower. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of farmers that said they have been to Paris is 20. It is lower. Nicely done, Matt. Thank you. Matt, you have a queen showing. What do you want to do with that queen? Lower. Okay, he's keeping it lower than a queen. It's a three. Higher. Higher than a three. It's a queen. Lower. Lower than a queen. No, a double. Are you serious? That's crazy. Well, Gary, you got a free chance. You must play off the five. Higher than a five. Higher than a five. It's a king. Lower than a king. Lower than a king. It's a three. Higher than a three. Higher than a three. It's a four. Higher than a four. To win the first match. Higher than a four. You did it, Gary. Okay. <laughs> well, Matt, well, that's only one match lost. We're going to definitely see you again. And uh, Gary, nicely played. You have $118,595. And we're going off to the money cards to see if we can add another $160,000 to the jackpot, okay? Fabulous. All right. Well, let's get there. That game went very quickly. First round, I was a little nervous there, but all honesty. Yeah, I guess by your Buffalo Bills winning, your luck is uh, going. Well, at least uh, well, you were uh, screwing up our names because you're pissed about us beating us. Yeah, <laughs> but you know, you know, I mean, in all honesty, I uh, wish everybody good luck for the game. I was just kidding. I know you were. Yeah, but uh, all right. Now you got the. Uh, we're gonna play the hundred sixty thousand dollar money cards. And you seen how the money cards went the last time? Do I need to explain the rules? Uh, nope. Okay. Well, you know the jackpot is at two hundred and fifty five thousand nine hundred dollars, and you won. And you won the first match. Now, since you know how this goes, um. Choose a number between 151 and 52 to cut the deck. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to say, you know what, let's do number 52. Going 52, and once the cards are set up, we'll put $1,000 in your bank. There it is, and for $1,000, your first card is an ace. The whole pot lower. Everything lower than an ace, it's a jack. $2,000 in a jack, Gary. Whole pot lower than a jack. Everything lower than a jack, it's a two. All of it higher than a two. Your cards are rolling now, aren't they? Everything higher than a two, a push. No win, no loss, but we're gonna put you up to the second level, and we add $2,000 to your score, you're up to $6,000, you have a two. Let's go all of it higher. Okay, everything higher than a two. 
It's a queen. Twelve thousand dollars on a queen. Everything lower than a queen. Risking it. Everything lower than a queen? No, it's a bust. Yeah. Well, Gary, we did not add anything to the jackpot, so the jackpot remains at two hundred and fifty-five thousand nine hundred dollars, and. We're gonna go off and take a little break, guys, and when we come back, we'll do our second match of this uh, tournament. Don't go away.